Have you ever wondered who is behind the magic of AI tools like ChatGPT or Gemini? These incredible systems don't just appear out of thin air. They are built and fine-tuned by some of the most innovative minds in tech – LLM engineers. If you are into AI, love problem-solving, or just want to explore a cutting-edge career, this video is for you. My name is Daniel and today we are diving into what it takes to become an LLM engineer. Whether you're just curious or seriously thinking about stepping into this field, I am here to guide you through every step of the way. But before we dive into today's video on becoming an LLM engineer, let me quickly share something with you that could save your digital life. Guys, we've all been there. One moment you're watching a video or working on an important project and suddenly it won't open or the file is corrupted. That feeling of panic when you realize your data might be lost forever can be pretty overwhelming, right? Whether it's a broken video file, a corrupted document, or something else, it's enough to ruin your day. But don't worry, I've got a solution that can save you from that headache. This is a powerful tool that can help you repair corrupted or damaged video files, photos, and documents and bring them back to life. It's super easy to use and supports a wide range of file formats. So no matter what type of file you're dealing with, it can help restore it. With Wondershare Repair It, you can simply upload your corrupted files and it'll automatically analyze and repair them for you. Whether it's fixing a video that won't play or recovering an important document, Repair It does all the heavy lifting. And the best part? You get to preview your repaired files before saving them to make sure everything looks good as new. And what's more, they are the first in the industry to support repairing gyroscope data and rewriting in PPTX format. If you've ever faced the nightmare of corrupted files, Wondershare Repair It is definitely worth checking out. I've dropped the link in the description so you can try it out for yourself and get your files back in no time. So, my friends, if you want some peace of mind knowing your precious files can be saved even when disaster strikes, check out Wondershare Repair It. There's a link in the description below, so go and try it now. Trust me, it's worth it. Thanks so much to Wondershare for sponsoring this video. And now, let's get started. What is an LLM engineer? Alright, let's start with the basics, guys. LLM stands for Large Language Model. These are advanced AI systems that can understand and generate text, like ChatGPT or Gemini. An LLM engineer is someone who specializes in working with these models, fine-tuning them and integrating them into real-world applications. Think of them as the people behind the curtain, making sure these AI tools work smoothly and solve problems effectively. It's a role that combines technical know-how with creativity, as you're always looking for new ways to make AI smarter and more useful. What do LLM engineers do? So what does the job actually look like day to day? LLM engineers are responsible for fine-tuning models to perform specific tasks. For example, if a company wants an AI tool that can analyze legal documents, the engineer would train the model using specialized data to make it excel in that area. They also design prompts which are like instructions for the AI to get the best possible output. On top of that, they integrate these models into apps or business systems, ensuring everything works seamlessly. Basically, LLM engineers are the bridge between complex AI technology and real-world solutions. Educational background Let's talk about education, folks. Most LLM engineers have a background in computer science, software engineering, or data science. A bachelor's degree in one of these fields is a great starting point. Some people go even further, earning master's degrees or PhDs, especially if they are interested in research. That said, this is the field where self-learning can take you a long way. There are plenty of online courses and resources that can teach you what you need without a formal degree. The most important thing is to build a strong foundation in AI, machine learning, and programming. LLM Engineer's Skill Set and Tools Now, let's talk about the skills and tools you will need to succeed. First and foremost, you need to be comfortable with programming, especially Python. It's the go-to language for AI and machine learning. You'll also need to know how to work with machine learning frameworks like TensorFlow and PyTorch. Familiarity with pre-trained models like OpenAI's GPT or Google's BERT is essential too. And beyond the technical stuff, soft skills like problem solving, creativity and communication are super important. And don't forget about tools like Hug and Face, which make it easier to work with, and fine-tune AI models. How to become an LLM engineer? A step-by-step -step guide. Alright, my friends, let's break this down step by step. Becoming an LLM engineer might seem like a huge task, but if you take it one piece at a time, it's totally doable. Whether you're starting from scratch or already have some tech experience, these steps will give you a clear path forward. Step 1. Understand the basics of AI and machine learning. First things first, you need to build a solid foundation in artificial intelligence and machine learning. 
Don't worry, there are tons of beginner-friendly resources out there. Start by learning what machine learning is, how algorithms work, and the role of data in building AI systems. Platforms like Coursera, Datacamp, Udemy, or YouTube have great tutorials that explain these concepts in simple terms. Step 2. Learn programming. Next up, you've got to learn how to code. Python is the go-to language for most LLM engineers, because it's versatile and has tons of libraries for AI and machine learning. Focus on understanding the basics of Python first, like syntax, loops, and functions. Once you're comfortable, move on to libraries like NumPy, Pandas, and TensorFlow. These are essential tools for working with data and building AI models. Step 3. Get familiar with NLP concepts. Since LLMs are all about processing and generating human language, you need to understand the basics of natural language processing, or NLP. Start with simple topics like tokenization, stemming, and sentiment analysis. Then dive into more advanced topics like embeddings, transformers, and attention mechanisms. Books like Speech and Language Processing by Jarofsky and Martin can be a great resource, but online tutorials work just as well. Step 4. Study large language models. Now it's time to focus on LLM specifically. Learn about popular models like GPT, BERT, and T5. Understand what makes them unique, how they trained, and what kind of tasks they excel at. You can find papers and blog posts from OpenAI, Google, and hugging face to get insider knowledge about these models. It's important to not just understand how to use these models, but also to know the concepts behind them, like transfer learning and fine-tuning. Step 5. Master the tools and frameworks. LLM engineers rely on specific tools to build and deploy models. Familiarize yourself with frameworks like PyTorch and TensorFlow, which are the backbone for training AI models. Hugging Faces Transformers library is also a must-learn. It makes working with LLMs way easier. Additionally, learn how to use tools like Jupyter Notebook for experimentation and Git for version control. Step 6. Get hands-on experience. Theory is great, folks, but nothing beats actual practice. Start working on small projects, like creating a chatbot or building a text classifier. Platforms like Kaggle have tons of datasets you can use to experiment. You can also try fine-tuning a pre-trained model using Hugging Faces tools. The key here is to keep experimenting and learning as you go. Step 7. Build a portfolio. Once you've worked on a few projects, showcase them in the portfolio. This is what employers will look at to see what you can do. Include links to your GitHub repositories and explain each project in simple terms. Highlight any innovative solutions you came up with or challenges you overcame. A portfolio is your ticket to standing out in a competitive job market. Step 8. Network with the AI community. Networking is super important, folks. Join online forums, attend AI meetups, or participate in hackathons. Platforms like LinkedIn and Twitter are also great for connecting with other AI enthusiasts and professionals. Don't be shy about sharing your work and asking for feedback. The more people you connect with, the more opportunities you'll come across. Step 9. Apply for entry-level roles or internships. Once you've got the skills and the portfolio, start applying for jobs. Look for roles like machine learning engineer, AI developer, or NLP specialist. Entry-level positions or internships are a great way to get your foot in the door and gain real-world experience. Be prepared to showcase your knowledge during interviews, especially in areas like Python, machine learning, and NLP. Step 10. Keep learning and growing. Finally, remember that AI is a fast-evolving field. Stay updated with the latest advancements in LLMs, like new models or training techniques. Follow research papers, attend webinars, and take advanced courses to keep your skills sharp. The more you learn, the more valuable you'll be as an LM engineer. And there you have it, folks. Follow these steps, stay consistent, and you'll be well on your way to building a rewarding career as an LLM engineer. It's a journey, but every step you take gets you closer to your goal. Keep at it. Demand for LLM engineers and salary expectations. Let's talk about the demand and what you can expect to earn. Guys, this is one of the hottest fields in tech right now. Businesses across industries are looking to use AI, so there's no shortage of opportunities. Starting salaries for LLM engineers are usually around $100,000 a year, and experienced professionals can make over $200,000 annually. If you're in a high-demand area or working for a top-tier company, those numbers can go even higher. The demand is only growing, so the timing couldn't be better to jump into this field. Final thoughts. All right, folks, let's wrap it up. Becoming an LLM engineer might sound challenging, but if you take it step by step, it's totally doable. This is a career where you get to work on cutting-edge technology and solve real-world problems. Whether you're interested in building smarter AI tools, streamlining business processes, or just exploring the future of tech, 
This is an incredible field to be in. So start learning, start building and take that first step. All right, my friends, and that's all about my step-by-step -step guide to becoming an LLM engineer. Feel free to check out the links in the description below. You might find some discounts there. As usual, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel. Thanks for watching. Until next time.